Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. I want to mention they're going to make a really simple, beautiful pasta. We're doing farfalle pasta, but you can use anything you want with zucchini and goat's cheese. It's very creamy. It's very delicious. Let's get on with it. Okay, let's get started here. So I've got some zucchini here, or courgettes, or kusa, whatever you call them, cut into rounds. Here I've got some cream. Now I get lots of questions about this. I'm using a thick cream, or as in England we would say a double cream. In America, I think you call that heavy, but it doesn't matter if you use a, a thin cream or a thick cream. It won't make any difference. It's all gonna work out the same. One onion, cut nice and small. Here I've got my goat's cheese, two teaspoons of oregano, a tablespoon of garlic, and here I'm using some green olives. Of course, use black if you want. Let's get to the cooker. Okay, the first step is we're gonna get our zucchini cooked. So I've got some olive oil in there. We're simply gonna drop all of our zucchini in there. Some salt. Some black pepper. High heat. Let's just fry these around for about four minutes or so. Okay, so nice little bit of colour on them. Out they come. Leave the oil in the pan. We've got some nice olive oil in there with some salt and pepper, and then we can move on. Okay, so we've got that nice seasoned oil there. We're on a much lower heat, just below a medium. We're gonna drop in now that onion. Our chopped garlic. And we're gonna go for about three minutes or so, stirring all the time. Beautiful, those onions are just starting to take. Let's drop in those olives. Now I've kept mine whole, the stones in there. Take the stone out and chop them up if you like. We're now gonna go for that little bit of dried oregano or oregano, as some of you call that. We're gonna get the zucchini or courgette back in. And again, another three minutes on this nice, fairly gentle heat. And then we're ready to add our cream and our cheese. Incredible. Okay, let's drop in that cream and like I say, thick or thin is not gonna make any difference really. I often get lots of emails, what cream is that, blah, 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 blah. I'm telling you now, thick or thin is all good. Now we're gonna get our goat's cheese in. I'm just gonna sort of crumble that in. I'm gonna leave a little bit back for decoration on top. Just a tiny amount just to sprinkle on the top. Then I'm gonna add some black pepper. I'm not gonna add any more salt. We put some salt in that oil when we were doing the zucchini and the cheese, the goat's cheese is very, very salty. Now get your pasta ready. I'm using a farfalle. You could be using a penne, spaghetti. It's up to you, anyone you like really. So, there goes my cooked pasta. And I'm now gonna be going for about another two or three minutes, getting this sauce all over my lovely pasta. And we're done, I'll see you at the table. Okay, and there you go. What I've done is I've just served that with a little bit of crumbled 
goat's cheese on the top, tomato and fresh parsley. Something like basil would also work as well, wouldn't it? Hope you enjoy that. Nice and easy. Absolutely delicious. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. That does help us out a great deal. A thumbs up helps us out even more. And a comment because we'd like to know you're fine. We'll see you soon. Lots of love. Thank you very much for taking time to watch our cooking videos. Hope you enjoy them. Lots going on. We've got a, a new vegan channel, which we're trying to promote at the moment. It's 100% vegan, so please check that out. Chef June has started his own Filipino cooking channel. He's still going to be appearing here with me on How to Cook Great, but he started his own one. And we've got Rahel, who's doing great stuff on her Amharic or Ethiopian cooking channel. So if you're into either of those things or those three things, please check them out. The links might pop up here or they'll be down below. If you'd like to support the channel, which I really do hope you do, you can by buying us a cup of coffee. It's gonna cost you a couple of dollars. Just follow the link, PayPal or whatever it is. Um, really, really would help us if you do that. I think that's about it. We're doing fine, we hope you're well. Subscribe to us, that helps us out a lot. Give us a thumbs up, we do like that. And more importantly, please do leave us a comment. We do like to hear from you and see what you're up to. That's it. Be safe. Be well. We'll see you soon. Lots of love.